have two cesspools in the front. Kevin Delaney has been living here in Lake Grove for more than 40 years. He says he understands the need to better treat sewage and protect the water, but he questions why Suffolk uses cesspools. How about we get sewage that, that we're able to, everything just goes there, like Nassau County had. I mean, that's where I'm originally from. Go, Uncle Kevin! Malone signed a bill banning the installation of new cesspools as the primary way of treating waste. Septic tanks will have to be used if they're not already installed. Environmentalists say cesspools cause nitrogen pollution, which damages the water quality here on Long Island. Not using cesspools means that we'll have less nitrogen and less pollutants going into groundwater and also into our marine water Lake and our lakes and streams and rivers. As of now, the new law only applies to homeowners and businesses that have to replace a failing cesspool. But there could be new policies put in place over the next couple of years. Those could include requiring an advanced nitrogen reducing system in any new construction when an old system needs to be replaced or when a property is sold. But for now, Malone says the new law is a small step in the right direction. It lays the foundation to move us towards a future where we are replacing systems with advanced septic systems that will treat for nitrogen and help us to reverse the decades of decline in water quality. In Lake Ronkonkoma, I'm Sherry Einhorn, News 12 Long Island.